So we drove down to Philly, and first thing on the menu, Philly, Philly cheese steaks. Oh, it's been a long time coming. I'm very, very excited. I've been wanting to try an authentic Philly cheesesteak in Philadelphia for the longest time. But when we react to food, Fats has the biggest smile. I've never seen her smile so much. Whenever it's food related. Is it my name, Fat Ima? <laughs> yeah, I guess so. <laughs> we don't really know what we're doing. We have got in touch with a friend of ours who is based in Philly, born and raised. Chef Chris Cho. He's going to show us what's up. Chris! Here he is. Yes. Oh, what's up? Yeah. How are you, brother? Good to see you again. Good to see you. What's hey. up? Hey. This is my what's man, Chief Fine. Hey, hey, Chief. What's up? Nice, nice to meet you. you. Welcome to Philadelphia. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, this is going to be I good, I can tell. This is your hometown, right? Yeah. Okay. okay, okay. I love Korean food. Yeah. I love Philly. Yeah. And okay. you guys grew up on yeah. cheesesteaks. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. Now, everyone in New York that we talked to about going to Philly, they said, you're going to go to Pat's or Gino's. Yeah, which one are you going to? Pat's or Gino's? That was all anyone that said. That was the question. And then we got down to Philly, and everyone's like, you're not going to Pat's or Gino's, are you? <laughs> Don't go near that. <laughs> so we were like, of course well, not. Wouldn't yeah. dream of it. Confusingly named Angelo's Pizzeria. Yeah. So they, Pat, those two that they said must be the bait ones that are like quite commercial that everyone knows of thinking they're it's like good. Domino's yeah, or Pizza Hut. Or Pizza Hut. Yeah. But then it's like, when you live in Philly, people will be like, oh, you're going there. They will, they'll go to the more traditional, yeah. proper made ones. Like a local. Local, more locals, yeah. which do better ones, I yeah. guess. Yeah. Apparently pizza's good, but yeah. the cheesesteak is even better. As soon as that we walk in. I mean, it's, it's like the flipping stock exchange in there. Like, Rams <laughs> with people. Oh, you're on Charlie. That's us yeah. yeah. I we know. It's the best cheesesteak in Philly. <laughs> yeah. And we had to do a proper right. Philly, you yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. Angelo. Okay. All right. This is so heavy. <laughs> it looks like a baby. Baby, you know? yeah. Oh my god! Oh, yeah, I tell you, it weighs That's a heavy baby. That's a heavy baby. Let's go. All right, all right. Well, right. Let's get involved. You have Philly cheesesteaks wow. before? No, no, no I'm literally yeah, my first time. Food. Like Philly cheesesteaks. Don't know what to expect. It's quite famous, yeah. right? Everyone knows a Philly cheesesteak. You're here now, so just say cheesesteak. Oh, okay, so that's yeah, a doll. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In Philly, we yeah. call it cheesesteak. Oh, cheese when you leave out of Philly, people call it Philly. Yeah. Okay. Makes sense. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Like, it's a tautology. Yeah. 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 They don't say like Korean kimchi fried rice. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that, that makes sense. sense. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> you guys got the stamp now. You guys could call it cheesesteak. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Now we've been given permission. Here you go. Uh, Come on, open it. It's something that I've been wanting to try for a long time. Mm. You can't get cheesesteak in the UK for sure. No, yeah. well, I mean, you could get steak and cheese, uh, but we just well, never think to mix it together. That's true. Uh, <laughs> so this is the whiz one. So whiz in the UK means, um, well, to urinate. Yeah. Take a whiz. Uh, yeah, you yeah. don't say that in the it UK does, yeah. America. Oh, no. Yeah, so if someone gave you a whiz. <laughs> yeah, oh wow. Ooh, whiz steak, no. Whiz. But it's not a word that's often used. It's not like everyone in the UK says whiz, 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 whiz. It's just, you could use it as that word but it's not something you hear regularly yeah and people say take a piss or i mean i've never heard whiz other than for that term yeah well but i'm not saying it's not something it's not a go-to word for everyone yeah. to be like have you ever heard me or anyone in the i UK think say it depends whiz? on where you're from maybe, maybe like we're from london i've never heard whiz i know it's linked to the word but i've never heard yeah. it in london Sandwich is bad. No, hey, you want to okay. <laughs> <laughs> pixelate that? Yeah. Uh, okay. <laughs> this is the the classic yeah. recipe. Is that right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Whiz, yeah. whiz cheese. Now that's like the cheese that comes out of the can. Is that whiz? Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, I must say, it looks like this is how fish and chips comes in the UK. Yeah. yeah. This is exactly oh, how it comes. Oh my gosh. Oh. oh I wow. bet that's going Let's go. <laughs> that's a lot of meat. Yeah. No wonder it's so heavy. Look at that. Oh my. Yeah. Yeah. Chapstick. Just go for it. Cheers, man. Cheers. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, oh man, yeah. it's so good. I bet. Let's go. Mmm. 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 Mm -hmm. Wow. Mmm. -hmm. Mm. Oh my god. And they use the sarcoma seeded bread, so. I was about to say, uh, uh, that bread mm -hmm. is incredible. Mm -hmm. That that genuinely tastes like coronary heart disease. <laughs> you know? Wow. Oh, like, well, yeah. Seriously. I mean, it tastes like not being able to see your grandkids. <laughs> <laughs> tastes that good, I guess. No, so when you're younger, you eat them more often. As you get older, you kind of slow down. It goes once a week, once a month. It changes okay. for people, you know, because okay. it's like it's like it's like lollipops. Yeah. You know, I can't remember the last time I had a lollipop. Exactly. But when I was when I was a kid, all Loving the time. It. In New York, we had a sandwich called a, a chopped cheese. Mm. Mm. And there were similarities in like the cheese is definitely very similar to this. Mm. The bread, this is like crispy bread on the outside, really soft in the middle. This absorbs some of that beef fat. The beef though. In the chopped cheese, I feel like it was like almost like hamburger meat. Yeah, chopped up. You're like that. It's meaty. Like, like.
You'll love that. I'll like it as well. But I'm I think salivating over she, here. she loves like beefy kind of beef burgery style I love stuff. It. I love this. sandwiches. I love burgers. Yeah. I love pizza. This is heaven to me. We need to go to the US yeah. so we can try some of this ourselves. I guess mm. that's why you call it a steak. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Depending on where yeah. you go, they usually use uh, ribeye meat. Ribeye. Rib right. Okay. So it's literally ribeye steak chopped up. Okay. Firstly, I feel like you guys should try the Wiz version. This is like the classic, right? <laughs> Feeding the yeah. team. Wow. Yeah. How cheesy and beefy and just. So good. I could have that two or three times a week. It's so <laughs> soft in there. It's almost like a beef smoothie, you know? Beef yeah, and cheese almost, smoothie. Yeah. Like, if that I mean, was that any. sounds disgusting, but. <laughs> yeah. It tastes delicious. If that was any smoothie, you could suck it up with a straw. Wow. Uh, wow. Well, here we go. Mm. Not the best image, but yeah. Ooh. Wow. I can. Finley's not messing around. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know why this is famous. Uh huh. Yeah. They did a good job too. You know, like like I said, they're they're a new spot, Philly. Mm -hmm. We kind of hate on a new spot, but they yeah. deserve it. Look at this. Everybody just loves yeah, it. There's a lot so. of people. Everyone in New York is like, oh, you want a Pat's or Gino's? When we said Pat Gino's, you guys both were like, no. I like that they went to a new spot to help them out because obviously Jolly's got a massive audience, US and UK, and as we know, a lot of UK people visit the US. Like, we didn't know about this place. And if we could ever go to Philly, where would we go? This place now, because that's the place yeah. we think is going to be yeah. good now, because they're saying it's good food. So mm. it's good they've done it. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I still take people there all the time. Okay. Like when my aunts come, my cousins come, okay. you still got to take a, because it's, it's the classic. They got like a bigger sign that right. says Pats and saying, Gino's. You could take commercial. a little picture in front. But here, it's not like a, you're here to eat, you know? Oh yeah, history as well. Yeah. Napkin dealer, wow. yeah. thank you very much. <laughs> and so how's this different from Pats and Gino's then? Pats and Gino's are sliced. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Okay. It's so a bit harder to chew through, I imagine. A little bit. It almost looked like a prugogi slice, just oh. like sliced oh. off top. Ah. Yeah. But some people like that yeah. too. Yeah. Some yeah, people yeah. like slice, some people like chop. I get past it, you know, don't get me wrong. When okay. I'm drunk at 1 a.m., that's the time. The okay. Uber Eats are coming that's through. The time. Oh. They're not open yeah. at 1 a.m. Okay. 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 Oh, yeah. wow. They sell out. Okay. So we just had the more original recipe, the classic, the cheese whiz. This is... That's Cooper Sharp. Cooper Sharp. What, what is that? <laughs> just, what's Cooper Sharp? I swear, Chris is nice. He knows everyone. Yeah. <laughs> this is your hometown, huh? Yeah. You know everyone. <laughs> just walking Family like friend. Little, yeah. Like a little community here. Yeah. All right. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Whoa, look at that. Yeah. So the cheese, the cheese is really what's different here. Yeah. Oh, wow, there's yeah. a lot of onions yeah. as well. I wonder which so one they're going to prefer. Onions are more prominent. Yeah. yeah. I think they'll prefer you this one. Like you might yeah. yeah. like this better. Yeah. You reckon? He just said... This is what they recommend. To be honest, cheese with it's good when you're young because you don't okay. know the quality of cheese. So when we're you're old. Young. I mean, we're old. Yeah, we're we know it. <laughs> Older. Yeah, right. He's like, yeah. Come on. Yeah, we are old. <laughs> Cheers, mate. Cheers. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Get in there, boy. He likes it. He has a hinge jaw for that. Wow. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Yeah. okay, I see what you mean about it being it's a more sophisticated flavor. Well, it is. It is. Yeah, yeah. I, need, cool. I need a little I need all like that one what, what cheese is that? Cooper Sharp. Cooper, Cooper Sharp. Sharp. I don't know if we have that in the UK. No. It's incredible. Really? It's incredible. It's, it's got a different tang to it. Mm -hmm. yeah. Which one do you like better? That would be my lunch time. You know that, yeah? Just all you need is one of those sandwiches for lunch. You're done. It looks delicious. Mm, imagine how... Oh, the I flavor. I could feel the flavor in my cheeks. The onion. And that cheese. Delicious, man. This is decadent. Yeah. yeah. This is decadent. Yeah, like, yeah, that yeah, is. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to crave that. Yeah. yeah. As soon as we get back to London. Yeah, that's a this crave is, one. This is one, one gonna It's quite simple, wow. isn't it? Yeah. Right? If you think it's just like bread, high quality meat, wow. onions, cheese, that's it. Yeah. yeah. They, they do it and they do it right. Mm. Why is it yeah. so simple? But so hard to get. Yeah. yeah. Like honestly, so pe well. pe people in Philly, anytime there's cheesesteak outside of Philly, mm -hmm. oh, yeah, we're we really just hate on it. I'm not gonna lie. That's what you know, like, oh that ain't real Philly cheesesteak. But how hard is it to get it? Yeah. <laughs> no, but people do get it yeah. wrong sometimes, yeah. you know? Yeah. So Philly's known for cheesesteaks. It's known for rowdy Eagle, oh, yeah. Eagles fans. No. Good boy! It's known for brotherly love, I suppose. Oh, yeah. Philadelphia. What else should we do you while we're, we're here? For pretzels? Meek Mill. Pretzels, huh? water ice. Mm, uh, water ice. Water ice. It, we kind of call it like water ice. Yeah. Like we pronounce Sorry, it what? water ice. Water, yeah. water they ice. They say that's like, oh, yeah. like what? What an ice. Yeah. But isn't water, water ice? ice water? I think that's more Asian, no? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> isn't all ice water? Water, water ice. Water ice. Oh, it's like sorbet. Yeah, you kind of like oh, it. Oh, that looks nice. Okay. Sorbet is okay. just 
way more high quality okay, to be honest. Okay, okay. yeah, yeah. okay. This is simple. Yeah. I mean, it's in the name. Yeah. Water, yeah. ice. And we've heard a lot about Wawa's as well. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Wawa. Yeah. Yeah. We should check out Wawa. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> Wawa. What's Wawa? <laughs> <laughs> I forget because yeah. when Danny comes back to oh, yeah, Philly, he, Wawa, he always right. go to Wawa. But yeah. for me, it's like going to Korea and be like, hey, want to go check out 7 Eleven? It's right. like, right. oh, I guess that's a thing. But yeah. Wawa is huge here. Yeah. Forget no, that we don't have it outside of Philly. Okay. So if we go to Wawa, what should we order? Hoagies or food? Hoagies. You know what? What hoagies are? Uh, it's a Subway? Sub sandwich? Or Subway? Like this? Kind of like that, that no? Cold, cold, cold cuts. Cold cuts. Cold cuts. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Sorry. Are you a fan of cold sandwiches? I don't mind, but when I'm hungry, I like my food warm. Same. Yeah. Like, I don't mind. Like, a cold sandwich feels like a packed lunch. Yeah, it's just. It doesn't like a a proper, to me. It yeah. doesn't feel like I've. You've yeah. eaten properly. I, have, I don't feel satisfied. Same. That's the one thing about cold food, like that, like yeah. cold sandwiches. I think it depends on the, like, the type of food as well. Mm. Those Philly the cheesesteaks, though. Yeah, they that will, looks delicious. Yeah, they'll yeah. put you to sleep, man. Yeah. Philly, we call it hoagie. I think New yeah. York call or other places call it hero yeah. or Subway. Uh, and in England, Subway. we call it sandwich. How do you well, differentiate the sandwich? We don't, There's, really. No, yeah. we don't. <laughs> it all just yeah, sandwich. Uh, yeah. So when someone's like, hey, you want some sandwich, how do you know it's going to be like this? Or no, the I mean, we don't. You just get that's the problem. We legit don't. We just. Should we just call it a sandwich? And then just hope for the best. <laughs> <laughs> they like have different ranks of sandwich. Yeah. In fairness, oh, in yeah. fairness <laughs> let's be honest, we don't have many good sandwiches in the UK. Yeah, we don't. If someone asks for a sandwich, generally. Whoa. Okay, 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 okay. We don't. Listen, Whoa. If someone. Yeah, sure. you don't Excuse you get us, me. Don't Excuse me. On behalf of our nation and the king, this is the comparison. It's not a sandwich. It is a sandwich. That's exactly what they're saying. We don't. It's so good. They can't accept that it's a sandwich. It is a sandwich. That's, he's right. In yeah, the UK, our sandwiches are so. That's what we call a sandwich. Us, in the UK, our sandwiches are so basic. If a subway, it's a sandwich, no? Yeah. That's probably the most complex we get is a subway. If you guys know what that is, I'm sure you've got a subway in the US. <laughs> they do, because yeah. he just mentioned subway. That's like the most big boy sandwich yeah. you can get. I don't call this a sandwich, Listen. right? No. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have a word for things like this. When, we, when you say you want a sandwich in England, it's two flat pieces of white toast bread. Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. with, with maybe some ham and cheese in the middle, some cucumber and cream cheese. I mean, it doesn't True. get that exciting. Yeah. Well, thanks okay. so much, guys. Of course. Thank um, you. We would never have found this place without you guys. Appreciate it. Yeah. That's incredible. <laughs> I'm glad you guys liked it. I'm glad you guys that liked it. That was a life yeah. memory, right? Yeah. yeah. My Seriously. first ever cheese steak. Philly cheese steak yeah. on Before the street. Before cheese steak, we shook hands like this. After cheese steak. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <It's> messy. <laughs> if we tried to, it would have just just slide straight off. If you aren't following Chef Chris Cho yet, check him out. Some of the best Korean food oh, he's a you can find in the States. Right here. Hell yeah. Uh, if you haven't come to Philadelphia, Angelo's man, that was an incredible. Angelo's. Thank you guys for putting we'll Philly on the map yeah, too. Yeah. So no, 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 that is there, <laughs> there are plenty of maps on which it features. <laughs> <laughs> you guys saw that, right? As soon as they walked in. Philly cheesesteaks though. I want a Philly cheese steak. That is, look, that looks like proper comfort That is what you food. call a sandwich. Yeah, proper sandwich. Not no little... Toasted. Warm. They were toasted. They it's put a crisp, the grill, it's a crispy in the edges, soft in the inside, and it's absorbing all the steak and the cheese. Melted cheese, onions. The steak looked good. There was a lot of, like, it was a lot. That's a lot of protein. I wouldn't have to worry about my protein intake in that meal. Yeah, you really wouldn't. <laughs> Guys, thank you so much for recommending the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Keep recommending some videos on the comment section below. For now, peace out.